there's a relatively new and potentially destructive engine phenomenon known as Meganock or Supernock. Well, the technical name is low speed pre-ignition and it's the topic of today's Mighty Minute. Automakers have unique challenges when designing today's cars. They have to meet ever tighter emissions and fuel economy standards while still meeting our desire for overall performance. The result? Lower displacement, turbocharged, gasoline direct injection engines that are making the kind of horsepower engines twice their size made a decade ago. Now these advances don't come without a price. Some of these newer engine designs, when operated at low RPM and high load conditions, can be more susceptible to pre-ignition than their old port-injected counterparts. Now this type of pre-ignition is referred to as LSPI, or low speed pre-ignition. It's also called stochastic pre-ignition, or SBI. Liquid fuel droplets can combine with emulsified motor oil, typically ejected from the crevice in the top piston ring groove, to form a mixture that has a lower octane than the fuel alone. It will lead to an undesirable detonation event. Detonation, also known as NOC, is the process where the air-fuel mixture in the combustion chamber literally explodes in a fast and very violent event. Now, during a detonation event, burn speeds will go supersonic, and when the sound barrier is broken, you'll hear that audible knock coming from the engine. At the same time, pressures in the cylinder can exceed three times the norm. In addition, this pressure spike is also occurring before the piston rod and crankshaft are in position to transfer this pressure into positive energy. Large detonation events, though, can bend connecting rods, crack pistons, and blow head gaskets. So what can you do to help prevent LSPI from occurring in your customer's engines? First, make sure they're using fuel with the correct octane rating for their cars. Most consumers opt for the lowest octane rated fuel due to cost. But if their vehicle requires one with a higher rating, it's really costing them more than they're saving. And recommend the use of top tier fuel as well. You can find out more about top tier fuel at www.toptiergas.com. Second, encourage your customers to change their engine's oil based on the severe duty service interval and their owner's manual. Many studies show that LSBI is prevented well by oil while it's fresh, but that protection can drop as the oil ages. And after all, an oil change is a lot cheaper than a new engine. And of course, use the correct oil for the application, like Mighty Engine Guard and the correct viscosity. Now effective May 1st, there are new oil certifications also in place to address the concerns of LSBI and others. But that's a topic for our next time together on the Mighty Minute. Thanks for watching.